doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus France. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris is the goalkeeper. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Kylian Mbappe starts with Ousmane Dembele in the wide positions. And leading the line today, Olivier Giroud. And the contest begins. Giroud might be a chance here. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. Well, France are the holders. Not too many people doubted them coming into the tournament. And quite frankly, they've rubber stamped. Oh, Derek, what a moment this could be. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. <laughs> Can someone get on the end of this? Well, not the best clearance. Upamecano, determined defending. Being pressed and pressed high. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll Very see? big moment, this. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Judgment error by the keeper. Joao Felix. Flag up, tight offside.
perfect tackle. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And France pushing forward with options available. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. And no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And do they mean business on this occasion? Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, they could give it away. Upamecano. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. He must finish! Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Couldn't keep it. And he's beaten him here, but no damage done. That's the main thing. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, disappointing end to the move. Ruben Neves. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Felix and he takes it on and he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly Chouameni good tackle, take it away can he find the right pass? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. <laughs> Upamecano. Can he convert? the keeper <laughs> and over it comes will they make it count and there it is living history the opening goal 2022 World Cup final incredible celebrations well let's look at this again it's a decent delivery into the box but you do have to ask questions of the keeper could he have done better here I think so you can't be beaten at your near post like that
And Portugal get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Now can they come up with a quick response? A creative look about this. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Silva. On the ball, Ruben Dias. Ruben Neves. Cristiano Ronaldo. Strong but fair tackle. Take some progress with the ball at his feet, but quick thinking defensively. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes. And so it is, the first half story has been written. And the match begins. Well, just fractionally wide. Good strike. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Upamecano. Can he convert? Ball the keeper. And over it comes. Will they make it count? And there it is. Living history. The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup final. So underway again with Portugal looking to find a route back into the game. Real chance. Well, just narrowly over the crossbar. Good hit, though. Oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. Oh, not to be. That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late, and he deserved a booking for that. And a no-nonsense clearance. Griezmann. 
No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. And really intense pressure applied. Lovely work to get past his man. Might it be Mbappe? Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal. Goal! So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Number 10, Kylian Mbappe. Wonderful save. <laughs> the Esman tasked with taking the corner. Well, not the best clearance. Threat over for now, it seems. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And intercepted there. <laughs> 30 minutes to go, then. Well, France have controlled possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Ottavio. Perfect challenge. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Determined defending. Griezmann. Aurelien Chouameni. Losing possession. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Running with the ball confidently. Wonderful chance. Real defensive resilience. A good and fair challenge. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Giroud. teammates around him and it wasn't taxing for the keeper a quarter of an hour remaining here good movement and credit is due for that good piece of defending Uber Meccano For Meccano, he read the situation defensively and did his job. Really good challenge. Bruno Fernandes. Plenty of support here. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. 
And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Well, no way to put a positive spin on that one. Disappointing. Well, I don't think he'll be on the next free kick, will he? That wasn't good at all. Rabiot. Oh, he looks threatening. Takes it off. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Silva. Bruno Fernandes has it. France come away with it. Well, the referee trying to play advantage there, but it wasn't forthcoming. Ronaldo. Now, this could be productive. Putting his body on the line. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. A foul, but advantage played. Well, it wasn't much of an advantage in the end. And he's retrospectively awarded the free kick. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. Well, possession seeded. It is a decent looking attack here. The high press was very much on. And he takes on the shot. And the keeper more than equal to it. And now it's all over. France are world champions for the third time. And there's no doubt about it, Derek. They've been the best team in the tournament. France, the world champions. It takes a massive effort to win back-to-back -back World Cups. But Stuart, that's what France have done. And they fully deserve it as well. They've been excellent throughout the tournament. The coach has done the right things. They've had a good team spirit. And just think of those fans. They've got right behind this team. Brilliant for them. And so the battle commences.